I created this art in less than two minutes. Are you interested in creating your own beautiful artwork like this, or this, or even this in just a few minutes? By finding at the right prompts, let me show you. There's an AI art generator called Midjourney that can help you do just that. It's super easy to use, and after learning about some super basic knowledge, you'll be able to produce beautiful images yourself. And this tutorial will show you how. First, you'll need to download Discord if you haven't already. You can think of it as a messaging app for communities. After you create a Discord account by providing the necessary information, you'll be able to enter Midjourney and begin generating your own artwork by giving it prompts. So, you have to set up Discord and now you can use it to join the Midjourney server. It's really easy, just follow these steps. First, go to the link discord.gg slash midjourney. You can find this link in the description below. Then, you just need to confirm the invite to join the Midjourney Discord server. Once you're in, you can interact with it easily. If you're new, you can navigate to one of the new member channels and type slash imagine. This will allow you to tell the server the keywords of what you want it to generate. All right, so I wrote a poker table scenario for the program, and now I'm gonna give it two instructions to make the result look really good. But before we get started, let me tell you one more important thing. To get the best results, you need to type dash dash v5. This will make the program use version five of Midjourney, which is the best one. Also, I will be using dash dash AR 2 by 3 to pick the aspect ratio, which means how the image looks on your screen. You can choose between 2 by 3, 1 by 1, or 3 by 2. Once you've typed those instructions, just hit the enter key and wait. And now, boom, look at the amazing result. Alright, so now you have 9 more options. The letter U stands for upscale. This means that if I like one of the options, I can make it bigger to fill up the whole screen. The letter V stands for variation. So if I like any of the options, I can press V to let the program know that I want to keep the same style, but different variations of that style. So I really like V2, as that is what is closest to what I'm envisioning, so I'll just click V2. So I think number 3 is my favorite, so I'll go ahead and click U3 to upscale it. And there you go. So the whole thing about Midjourney is that it's no longer free. The basic plan will cost $10 a month, which will allow you up to 200 images every month. So if you're interested in another amazing free alternative to Midjourney called Leonardo.ai, click this video here to get that set up for yourself in no time.